channel today we are officially decorating for fall yay so it has finally cooled down a little bit in florida and by cool down i mean like 80 degrees but it's the middle of september so i figure might as well go ahead and decorate for fall so and if you know me a vlog is never complete of mine if i don't have coffee so today we are getting one of the starbucks fall drinks today it's either going to be the apple crisp macchiato or the pumpkin cream chai. So we're going to go to Hobby Lobby. We're going to go to TJ Maxx. And then we might do Target as the third store. I did go to Dollar Tree yesterday, but I did not vlog that. So I'm sorry. But I'll give a haul of everything that I got. And then we'll start decorating. So I'm so excited because this is my first time decorating a place for fall. I've never done it. So I'm really, really excited to do it. So I'm aiming for a combination of of reds, oranges, and browns for my place. Just because my place is really neutral and I keep it like that so I can switch things out like with the season. So yeah, if you like videos like this, be sure to give it a thumbs up and consider hitting that subscribe button and let's get on the road. Don't you wanna know that the time's changing? Don't you wanna know that the ride is This coffee literally tastes like fall in a mug. It is so good. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness, you guys. Apple crisp macchiato, four pumps of sugar-free vanilla. It is so good. I'm definitely getting this again. 10 out of 10 would recommend. Don't you want to I think this is cute. I think I like it. I think I'm gonna put it in the cart just in case, but I do like the way this one looks. I think we're gonna grab like two of these little garlands to put around my window. I think two should be enough. They have so much good stuff. I've picked out. <laughs> I picked out a whole theme for my living room, like outside area, and I am loving it. All right, that is a mission accomplished at Hobby Lobby. I found so much stuff that I was not expecting to find. So I don't have to get as much stuff at TJ Maxx, this, which is great. So now we're going to go to TJ Maxx. This one smells so good. It's vanilla pumpkin. I think I'm gonna grab this one because I love the way this one smells. Like, ugh. Oh, it smells so good. I also found this pretty one. It's so pretty. I'm not really finding much at TJ Maxx, so I might have to go to Home Goods after this, which is not what I wanted to do, but we're gonna check Home Goods. I did find this pretty pillows for my couch. I'm thinking of doing like a little orange color on my couch with like an orange blanket. I think that'd be really cute because my couch is cream, so I'm probably gonna head to Home Goods after this. So I really like this pillow. But I'm trying to see if I want like little accent pillows to go with these. These are pretty huge. This is falling down, so I have to hold it like this. But I'm trying to see if I put this black pillow with it. Will it look too Halloweenish like that? And then like, yeah, I don't like that. Never mind. I found this blanket for my room. I do like this one. Okay, so I'm at Home Goods right now, and I did find a little bit of stuff. I got this to accent. I can't reach it. There we go. I got this to accent the pillows on my couch since the big pillows are like orange so I think that'll look nice and I end up finding another reef that I like better so I'm just gonna buy this reef and then return the other reef that I got because it matches my aesthetic way better this one does so I found the pillows I don't really think I need anything else I was gonna try and find like a spoon rest in the shape of a leaf but I can't really find that here so I might just go home without it because like it's not like a total loss or anything like that so yeah they don't have a ton of like buy me stuff like nothing screaming to buy me so i might just check out with what i have but i consider this a pretty good success i picked up some little squishy pillows to go on my couch so that's gonna be like really really cute i have one this one for this end this one for the other end i hope this one ties in with the pillows that i have if not i'll just return it but it's fine all right, I just got home and I've got a ton, and I mean a ton of stuff. I'm probably not gonna keep all of it. Some things are going back because I don't know how it's gonna look, but I'm gonna start, hello. <laughs> I think we're gonna start decorating the living room. So I think we're gonna start with the couch first and transform that maybe, but I'm excited. So let's start decorating. Just put on my favorite sweater. 
so bad this was literally the bane of my existence that i just did on this window oh my god i was on the counters but here's the result Connecting pieces of a broken truth Wherever you go, it tags along You cling to it like a dancer clings to you I went back to where I once stood In that photo that was torn off on the side It's poked to me like no voice could And took me to where my heart used to hide Fog on the vine. Okay, it's literally 10 p.m. and I just finished eating and decorating everything. So I'm gonna turn you guys around to look at it and I am absolutely in love with it. Like I can't stop staring at all the pretty colors. Oh my goodness. Okay, here's the final reveal. Okay, so you come to the left and then this shelf, I just have this pumpkin here, this candle, it's a blood orange candle. I have another pumpkin here, another pumpkin here, and to the other side, I have this container that says harvest on it. And then my little stand has a pumpkin on it. Ignore the sparkling water, but it has a pumpkin on it. Here's the entertainment system. These little floral plants I actually made myself from Dollar Tree. The vases are from Hobby Lobby, which I got earlier. I just have pumpkins and trees and I have this beautiful pumpkin garland from Dollar Tree that goes across. So there's an overview. So then my table is the same thing. This little tray I got from Ross. This vase, everything is from Dollar Tree. I got this candle and it always has vanilla pumpkin and it smells so good. And I have another pumpkin right there. And here's another overview of the table. On my desk, I just threw some pumpkins and this little hello fall sign. There's another pumpkin right there. That's all I did for my desk. I don't really have any other ideas. So if you have any suggestions of what else to put on here, drop it down below. And then I think this is my favorite part, which is my couch. I decided to go with like a burnt orange with the cream couch and I absolutely love it. Like, look how pretty that is. That's, oh my goodness. Coming into the kitchen, I just have these towels that I got. And then in the window, I just put garland all along it. This was such a pain to hang, but it looks so pretty. And then watch when I turn off the lights. Look how pretty it is at night. On my coffee bar, I just have my little pumpkin mug that's out and then I put little wooden pumpkins in the shelf. And then I also have pumpkins in the windows just so it didn't feel so left out. In the bathroom, I have this pretty tree that I got from Hobby Lobby and then I just have a pumpkin. Coming into my bedroom, here is my bed. So it's the same garland from Dollar Tree. And then I just have these pillows. Here's what it looks like. And then on my desk right here, I just have some more pumpkins on it right here, on this desk. And then on this nightstand, I just have two little pumpkins right there. 
And then going along my bedroom window, I made the same thing that I have for my kitchen with the fairy lights. And then here is with the lights off. And that literally sums up my entire video. So thank you guys so much for watching me decorate for fall. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button down below. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye! If spring is the season that wakes me alive, then fall is the season to contemplate life, oh.